Ever since Benjamin Franklin discovered electricity, ever since Thomas Edison invented the electric bulb, ever since the scientist Michael Faraday's inventions formed the foundation of what is known as the electric motor technology, our world has changed dramatically. The use of electricity in our lives is immense. Today our lives are so much dependent on electricity. Our homes are powered by electricity. Our offices are powered by electricity. Our life is powered by electricity. The bread we toast, the water we heat, the mobile we charge, and even the cars we drive today are powered by electricity or electric power. Electric vehicles have really not come of age. Except for the likes of Tesla in the United States, others are still struggling and evolving in a big time. But brave hearts like Mahindra and Mahindra need to be commended for the incredible work they are doing on the electric motor front. Many years back, it was Chetan Mahani who brought out an electric car by the name of Reva. Subsequently, his company was bought over by Mahindra and Mahindra. Today, the company is known as Mahindra Electric and the car they manufacture is the E2O. The Mahindra team has since put in a lot of effort in the E2O, which was launched a few years back. And when it was launched, it was a two-door car. But now, for the first time, this car comes out in a new avatar with four doors, which makes a lot of sense. We are going to drive this car in fact, we are going to drive into the future. So step in and stay glued. The Mahindra E20 Plus literally makes no noise. Emits zero pollution, takes up only a small amount of space and merrily moves around without a fuss. Unlike its predecessor, the E20 Plus is finally what we can call a car. It's got four doors and one hatch. Everything about the new E20 Plus is fresh as a daisy. The looks have been vastly improved by a new smart grille, stylish integrated rear spoiler, spacious interiors, chrome accents, alloy wheels and a lot more changes on the technology front. The car now comes in four variants, P2, P4, P6 and P8. While the P2 is the 48 volt fleet model, the P4 is the 48 volt base, the P6 is the 48 volt top model and the P8 is the 72 volt top model. We got our hands on the P8. Shift the automatic gear to drive mode and off the silent machine will go like a boat on sails. The instant torque the direct drive machine generates will leave you surprised. The three-phase AC induction motor produces a whooping torque of 91 Nm at 2500 rpm. There is also decent peak power at 40 HP at 3500 rpm. Because of regenerative braking, a bit of charging happens every time you decelerate. Since the car does not have an engine and runs on lithium-ion batteries, the space under the bonnet is used to store the spare tire and tools for the car. The good thing is that the car can be driven around 140 km on a single charge and is maintenance free up to 5 years. The company is also offering 3 years or 60,000 km warranty on the E20 Plus. While the car can be fully charged in 9 hours, there is a provision to quickly charge it in 90 minutes in which case the car will be charged up to 95%. Finding a charging point could be the real issue and not the charging time. The interiors are indeed spacious in this small car. The car's overall dimensions have undergone a minor change. There is a boot space of 135 litres which can accommodate a good amount of your personal luggage. The rear seats can be folded too. The legroom for occupants both in front and rear is more than adequate and so is the headroom for tall passengers. The E20 Plus now comes with a blow-punked Android infotainment system that can connect to your smartphone as well. Remote diagnostics too can be attempted through telematics. While driving the vehicle was as simple as blowing in the wind, the car can be improved on few fronts. A chunkier steering wheel would have given a good feel to the driving experience. Also, while the air conditioner performed brilliantly, what needs to be fine-tuned are the norms on the dash. The Dash 2 in the E20 Plus could have been more tastefully done. With electrically driven vehicles getting better by the day and speeds too seeing a lot of improvement, we personally feel the new E20 or the E20 Plus is a must-buy for a family.
Now that you have watched this video and I'm sure you would have liked it and if you have liked it, don't forget to share this and also subscribe to our channel. My name is Roy P. Tharian and you've been watching the Motown India show. Today we have one such product from the Yamaha two-wheeler section which is the Cygnus Razy R.